we were in college, the very nascent um, idea came to us when we decided like we would love to do a silent film, but in a modern context. When we think about silent films, like we always think about like Charlie Chaplin's like City Lights and like Buster Keaton movies or Jacques Tati, and we thought, man, it'd be really special to do something in like the horror space, but just totally quiet and no dialogue. But we just didn't know how to, to make that work. The Quiet Place always had to focus on a single family, in part because the movie is a metaphor for communication, I mean, in a very literal way in terms of silence and survival, but the fact of the matter is this family also has their own interpersonal problems, and that's beneath the surface of the movie. We always felt that focusing on a family that has a rift is going to be the best window into a genre movie. What's great about John is he is a perfect blend of comedy and drama in terms of his acting style. I mean, certainly from his work on The Office or Away We Go and, and all the other films that he's done, like he always brings with him a sense of levity that has a dramatic edge to it. And certainly um, his work on The Office like has a lot of nonverbal cues in, in terms of his, his performance style. And I think that was a fantastic um, you know, piece of experience to be able to bring to the table. Yeah, and I remember when we first uh, went in to speak with our producer Platinum Dunes about this project they were like they kind of asked us like who are you guys thinking of like who would you guys um, consider and I remember saying like you know Emily Blunt would be a great mm -hmm. type for this movie we're not gonna get her but like she'd be great for this movie um, and we we're all kind of like yeah that would be nice <laughs> um, so it was like really exciting when when they kind of came together I hope that when an audience goes to see Quiet Place, they love living in the silence because the silence is so much more suspenseful than jump scares that you usually see in horror films. Um, I know that we go to movie theaters to see horror movies because it elicits a reaction from, from the audience. And so to sit in that silence and just wait and wait and wait, I think will be an incredible experience. And we also hope that they just really connect with the characters and, and come away feeling moved. Thank <laughs> you.